Hi there. If you watched yesterday's video, you know that there has been some bad news in the Shiba Inu ecosystem. Unfortunately, Apple's recent update might spell even more bad news for sheep and even the wider crypto market. What is this recent update and is there a way out of this? Well, keep watching this video to find out. Disclaimer quick, before we get into this video, you really want to hear this. It's meme coin season a time when meme coins deliver on ridiculous gains for their holders, so there's no better time to keep an eye out for new meme coin projects with potential. Maybe you missed out on your chance to get in on Shiba Inu and other similar projects early. Well, the gods of crypto may be handing you a second chance in the form of Akinu. Just like Shiba Inu, Akinu Inu is a truly decentralized project that allows holders to have real ownership of their project. The project has two solid audits from the best names in the game, including Static AJI. Inu also has several high-quality partnerships, including one with Baby Doge, one of the biggest meme coins right now. In fact, the team will be having an AMA with Baby Doge on May 1 cent, so you might want to look out for that one. Additionally, the AJI and you team will be live in Dubai on the Crypto 306 event which takes place from the 7th to the 8th of May. With the level of aggressive marketing that AJI and you is currently embarking on, there are signs that this project could be going parabolic soon. So if you're seeing this right now, you have the rare chance to get in early on a project with some potential. Check out the description for all the relevant links. Before we get into that, let's talk about Satoshi's recent cryptic message. I mentioned in yesterday's video that members of the Shiba Inu community have been getting antsy waiting for more updates on the Shibarium blockchain or really anything else Shiba Inu related. Satoshi had no other option but to respond in the Telegram group, telling the community that there are other things in the ecosystem that have been keeping people occupied. While that response was something ambiguous, Satoshi decided to make things even more ambiguous with his most recent comment. He simply wrote the word there in the Telegram group, and it wasn't even in response to anything or anybody. So it is really difficult, if not completely impossible, to figure out what he meant. And people in the Telegram group have been trying. One person replied to Satoshi's comment with a question about how beta is going. Another asked what's happening with the utility of Leash and another simply thanked him for his efforts. That said, there is a possibility that Chitoshi is trying to tell the community that Shibarium is ready to be launched, which would be great. It could also be that whatever the dev team has been working on with the beta tested is now on one word is just not enough to figure out what Satoshi has in mind. But there is no surprise here as Chitoshi loves to communicate in ambiguous terms or when whatever they are working on is ready to be launched, the dev team will let us know. Meanwhile, consider sharing your guesses with us in the comments section. What could Satoshi have meant as you were considering that? Let's talk about the Apple news. If you've been watching videos on this channel, you might remember when I talked about Apple adding the Bitcoin white paper to some versions of macOS. While we did not know what exactly this meant, you have to agree that it seems like good news. I mean, we've heard stories about Apple restricting crypto purchases on its devices. So if it was taking the step to add the Bitcoin white paper to macOS devices, it had to mean that it was changing their mind on crypto. Right. And if it was true that a brand as big as Apple was changing its mind on cryptocurrencies, it could mean that even more big brands would consider getting into cryptos too. So yeah, many crypto enthusiasts were excited about finding out about the white paper thing. Even SHIB holders had a reason to be excited because we've seen how, for the most part, whatever happens to Bitcoin usually rubs off on SHIB anyway. There's no need to go over what could have been because we just found out that Apple has removed the Bitcoin white paper from its latest Mac OS. Considering that we have no idea why the white paper was added in the first place because Apple did not provide any explanation. Chances that we will find out why it has been removed are practically non-existent, but it has not stopped people from trying to take guesses. Now, something that is being considered in all of this is that while Apple has not explicitly mentioned support for crypto, Apple CEO Tim Cook has publicly spoken about owning cryptocurrency since as far back as 2021. So we know that at least one of the people that makes the important decisions at Apple is not anti-cryptocurrency, which might mean that the removal of the white paper isn't completely bad news. However, there's also the possibility that the addition of the white paper was just a joke or a stink. I know that it doesn't seem likely, but how else would you interpret the removal? A change of mind according to you today. 
Apple never offered an official explanation for the white paper's inclusion, leading many to speculate that it was an inside joke among Apple engineers or a nod to the growing significance of cryptocurrencies. Still, according to you today, another possibility is that Apple was using the white paper for testing purposes. That is because of how compact the document is. The company decided to add it to versions of their Mac devices to test things out. This does sound like a logical possibility, and if it is true, it would explain why the white paper document has been removed if Apple is done with its tests. Of course, we still don't know what is really behind the addition and removal. But whatever it is, you are probably wondering what it means for cryptocurrency or sheep specifically. Well, at the very least it means that we have no idea what Apple's stance on crypto and sheep is. It doesn't seem to mean anything specifically positive or negative. It's just a state of uncertainty, which, if you think about it, is applicable with many other brands. That is, there are many brands that we have no idea what their stance on crypto or sheep is. That said, I should remind you at this point that this is just my opinion. It's not fact. You can share your thoughts on Apple's removal of the Bitcoin white paper and what it could mean for sheep in the comments section below. Also, if you found this really valuable, please drop a comment and share this video with friends. It really helps with the YouTube algorithm, thus helping me to keep increasing the quality of the videos. Finally, and still on this streak of possible bad luck, sheep burn rate has plunged drastically and by drastically I mean 100%. But before we get into that, this channel has a daily giveaway of 100,000 sheep for a chance to participate in the giveaway. All you have to do is subscribe to the channel like this video and leave a comment below. Hashtag Shiba and you. Good luck. Throughout yesterday, absolutely no sheep tokens were burned, which is terrible considering how much the price of sheep is dependent on sheep burns. You probably already know this, but it bears repeating that sheep burns help to create scarcity, which is supposed to help drive up the demand for sheep. This is the reason why, since she was launched, both the community and the dev team have been trying to come up with innovative ways to drastically reduce the circulating supply of sheep. There have been playlists Amazon purchases and berm wallets. What's more, the dev team has made sure that every Shiba Inu project release features a sheep burn mechanism and there have been brands that have volunteered to burn a fraction of the profit that they make from sheep. So it is safe to say that many people within and outside of the Shiba Inu ecosystem consider sheep burns very important. Unfortunately, nobody was interested in carrying out that important task yesterday. Now the community is used to the wild volatility and the amount of sheep tokens burned per day. There have been days when billions of sheep were burned at a time and other days when only millions of tokens were burned. However, it is rare where we have a day where there are no burns at all. So what could be the reason for this? It could be that people are tired because the burns haven't been having a huge effect on the price of sheep. For that to happen, there needs to be a lot more burns than we have been having so far. And Shibarium might be the only thing to make that kind of burn possible and Shibarium might be the only thing to make that kind of burn possible. Alternatively, it could just be that it is one of those days and tomorrow we'll see burn rates hike up again. Granted, we haven't seen rates go down this much, but it doesn't have to mean that there is cause for alarm. When Shibarium finally gets launched, chances that we'll see crazy burn rates are high because there won't be much effort to the burns. Every transaction will automatically result in a burn. After all, this is just me taking a guess though it could be any of the reasons that I just mentioned or something completely different. Meanwhile, it's time for you to tell us what you think. Burn rates dropped yesterday. Also, have you been burning sheep? Why or why not? Let's hear everything in the comments section below. With that becomes the end of this video. If you enjoyed the video, then please like this video and don't forget to leave a comment in the comment section. This really helps me with the YouTube algorithm. Also, please share this video to as many people as possible. Let's get this news out there.